Hey guys, it's Noah here from iHollywood TV. Well, you may know our next guest as host of the Emmy nominated The Kitchen and the new competition show Kitchen Crash on Food Network. He's dancing his way on over here this morning in his own kitchen with his new cookbook titled Come On Over 111 Fantastic Recipes for the Family That Cooks, Eats, and Laughs Together. Please welcome Chef Jeff Morrow joining us this morning on Skype. Hi. Hi, Noah. I'm so excited <laughs> to be here. Look at Look at I do I look I mean look I'm amongst flowers I'm dressed like a putting green and I feel great today it's a very it's a where we're all it's a metamorphosis it's a renaissance and right I'm right in the middle of it with my new book so very exciting stuff <laughs> oh okay so first off tell us how proud are you of this new cookbook that is filled with so many wonderful recipes because it's getting amazing reviews one in particular I like which was from book list they said this joyful cookbook is what post COVID dreams are made of that has to make you feel good right it's amazing. I believe that's a five-star review, Noah, even though there's no <laughs> dedicated stars. Sounds like a five-star review. Uh, you know, it. this took two years to, to physically write and produce, right? It's a yeah. long journey from the time they're like a book, a publisher is like, let's do a cookbook to the to today. Um, so it's it's a labor of love. And I feel like it's just like this, this birthing process and now it's out. But I've, what's inside is what counts. And that's just the stories from my youth, from my you know, not only being a, you know, my, my journey through food and family, mm -hmm. and it's filled with hilarious stories and quite super honest stories I've never told anybody and great photography and great recipes. And it's just an homage to my family mm -hmm. and my upbringing. We're showing a couple of pictures right now, and I mean, just, and, and two, in this cookbook, the recipes are so simple. I know my boyfriend and I, we made actually, um, we, we made the coconut chicken and the smoked barbecue cheddar crackers. Ooh. Yeah, they were so good. I mean, how did you right? come up with the whole cheese it idea to uh, make it like, you know, a smoked barbecue cheddar cracker? I mean, that's like so brilliant. I would never thought of anything like that. But just the seasoning of it all. I mean, it was so good. When you, when you smoke meat, you know, if you guys have a smoker, you know, it's a it's a long process and you often have to wait to eat that delicious flavored, smoky meat, pullable, right? Perfectly rendered. Mm -hmm. I wanted something that you could just throw on there. <laughs> While you're waiting maybe for the other meat to take eight hours to smoke, you got something quick and easy that gives you that same barbecue vibe. And yeah. I mean, I love a good two ingredient banger like that. So I'm, I'm glad you did those coconut chicken tenders. That's one of Lorenzo's favorites. I mean, oh. and it's good for you, right? Yeah. Look They're you, so you're good. glowing. Uh, yeah. Oh, you're glowing because you. of that recipe. Yes, I am glowing because of the coconut chicken. That's right. Thanks to my boyfriend for making it. I did the cheddar crackers, you know. Well, 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 that, that was wow, the easy well, part. You're one of those, huh? <laughs> you do the oh, a little easier oh, lifting definitely. on that one, don't you think, Noah? <laughs> oh, my God. So, you know, you actually have a delicious dish right in front of us. Uh, kind of talk us uh, through and take us about some of the recipes that you're going to tell us more on this morning. All right. Everybody loves a fried chicken sandwich. I am the sandwich king. I was dubbed that 10 years ago by mm -hmm. a guy named, I don't know if you've heard of him. His name is Bobby Filet. And yeah. he said, you're the sandwich king. So I've had this career. So obviously I'm going to have a fantastic sandwich chapter and come on over. And this is one of my favorites from it because everybody mm -hmm. loves a crispy chicken sandwich. All the kids are waiting oh. in line in cars, fighting over these things, right? burning yeah. things down to get this. So I show you how to not only make the greatest chicken sandwich, the crispy chicken sandwich with all that craggly stuff, but do my own spin on it with the general so's preparation. Mm. That sweet meat you get at the food core, Chinese American chicken joint <laughs> with all that garlic and sweet hoisin and in there. And then we top it with a Chinese cabbage and then Every great sandwich needs a sauce, so we do a Chinese mustard aioli that has all that nose heat. You know the little packets mm. of mustard you get in your Chinese takeout. You yeah. can barely eat, like eat through, like <laughs> right. I mean, there's like there's no way you could consume more than like an eighth of a teaspoon. This tapers it and adds that heat and vibe to it. So little mm. tricks along the way that you can apply to any sandwich, any recipe ever. Mm. You know what? I really like the uh, cover, the cover art of this uh, cookbook. I, I like that you have like the yellow phone. You know, I for iHollywood TV, if you throw it back to maybe a year ago, we used to have a yellow set, like a yellow YouTube Did studio you really? set. Yeah, we had everything yellow. Now it was purple, but now we're doing it virtual from home. So, you know, we're sitting on the couch. But yeah, I, I really like this. Like, <laughs> how did the idea come about for the, I mean, the idea for the cover of your cookbook? 
I, uh, it, 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 it was during the photo shoot for all the other pictures, right. Uh, for the principal photography, for all the yeah. food styling stuff that we're like, let's go shoot. Let's try to bang out a cover. Mm -hmm. and I'm like, I got an idea. I told my buddy, Brian to bring over his wall phone, which is a landline. No, I don't know how I think <laughs> you're a very young man. I can tell. Oh, and I know all about a landline. Have, uh, you know about a landline. A lot of the kids today don't know that it's a landline. It's a corded thing. It plugs to the wall, goes through the mainframe to the system to the big headquarters downtown. So this one is attached to the wall. I had him take it off his wall. And I had this idea because I tell this story in the introduction of Come On Over about my mom. Uh, me hearing those words come out of her mouth when she was on the phone, right? With, with the headset on the shoulder, an 80-foot long cord, about 10 kids <laughs> trapped in the cord. And her being like, come on over. I'm, I'm making, you know, I'm making pasta. So anytime I heard those words come on over, I knew fun was coming. Cousins were coming over. Family was coming over. Friends. And of course, plenty of food was at mm. our disposal. So oh my that's kind of an homage to that. Yeah. Well, I got a picture of my mom in there too. Look oh. at, you think I'm lying. Look at that. Oh. oh that poor little child in there. Oh, die, choking. <laughs> there were no rules back then, Noah. <laughs> used to just eat anything. My mom used to just, you know, she's like, here, play with this, you know, crystal wine glass. Like, here's a switchblade. <laughs> what was one of your favorite um, things to eat growing up as a child? Mine was chicken and fries. Man. I still like that, but it's not that healthy to eat. But, you know. What is ch chicken and rice? Fries. Oh, no, I like chicken and rice, oh, too. Oh, chicken yes. and fries. Oh, yeah, chicken and fries. No, what? What kind of chicken? Fried chicken and fries? Yes, fried chicken and fries. Yes, or yeah. chicken tenders or strips or you know I, I'm down with anything. Anything with breaded and deep fried, right? Yeah, yeah. with fries. You need to <laughs> fries for your veg vegetable matter that you got to get in there. Growing up, man, for me it was like pepperoni pizza Friday nights, oh. right? Delivery. Yeah. Chicago were very uh, passionate about our pizza, so when mm -hmm. we order pizza, it's an event. It's either you know it's never a slice. It's always a whole pizza, either delivered or in the pizza place. Uh, to me, there's like nothing like when it come through and you smell it in that box and then you plop it down and you open it up and then you just descend upon it. Uh, by the way, you, you do have I a nice know. kitchen. Do you want to tour us around? No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> Why not? No, we'll tour you around. <laughs> oh my God. Listen. Oh God. Oh. Okay. This is on. where I, this is, these are my chicken resets, right? Because this oh. is, you know, I don't want to. Um. um. You want to see my you want to see my junk drawer? Oh, look at <laughs> we love to we see your junk drawer. We just cleaned the junk drawer. Look at that. It's clean. Uh, we got a oh, hi. Hi. So, right. We got nail files. We got <laughs> screwdrivers. Uh, and look at this. Want to see something weird? Yes. So, I'll show you this. This is a little glimpse. My dog groomer. We have two dogs, Pino and mm -hmm. Jojo. They're they're mini golden doodles. Oh. Um. My my uh, our groomer. Gave uh -huh. us a Christmas gift for when it was time. And look at these. Oh, it's wow. her actual hair that she shaved off them and put really? in a glass vessel for a Christmas ornament. Oh, that's... what do you think of that? That's is it creepy? <laughs> a little creepy, but it's it got like cute. little eyes. Uh, wow. Well, anyway, we've run out of time, everyone. But Jeff, you're a whole lot of fun. I could talk with you all morning long. You can go ahead and get his cookbook, everyone, available in stores online. Uh, definitely check it out. It has some incredible recipes. They're really simple. They're easy to, uh, you know, to make. And uh, I, I really like this a whole lot. And everyone can catch Kitchen Crash on Hulu, Discovery Plus, wherever you consume your watching of, of TV these days. Jeff Morrow, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with Thanks me. Thanks so much, Noah. It was my fun. pleasure. Yeah, thank take you. Care. Try. Bye bye. Too. Bye bye.